Hello and welcome to the video for what is a UMG root. The UMG root is the topmost parent in a user interface widget. By default it comes with a canvas panel but I've deleted it for this video. The UMG root has the appearance, interaction, and designer sections available to it. We'll start with the designer which has preview background. If we choose one of our pictures like this one, Preview background will take that image and set it to fill the entire size of your layout. This is useful if you have a UI designer who has given you a mock-up. You can slap it in the background and then you can put your individual elements on top of it to match. Next is our is focusable. This allows us to click on this root widget if it is enabled and not allow it to be clickable if it's not. This is useful for things like maybe an overlay or a tooltip or something you don't want to be interactable. Lastly, we have our color and opacity and foreground color. Let's set our color and opacity to something like a blue. You'll notice no change. Color and opacity applies to all of the children below it. So we'll also go ahead and drag a border in. We now have a blue border even though its color is set to white by default. We can change this as needed, and it's a great way to have everything cascade down to your children. Now, we have another option, foreground color. We'll change this to a nice red, but nothing changes. Foreground color only applies to things that have a foreground color option with inherit as a checkbox. We'll put text under our border. We'll go ahead and center it, and we will resize it, but you'll notice we still can't see it. Well, our color and opacity is set to not inherit from the root widget. We'll go ahead and check inherit, and there we go. We've now inherited that color in our root widget, and with one nice option, we can have a colored, schemed, styled widget all from two sections.